What's up guys, Deity Cthulhu here. Uh, I got something a little different for you again. So, I've been eyeballing something for the last couple months. It's called goat guns. What goat guns are, are there many replicas of actual firearms that is set like, uh, they're scaled size, smaller. You assemble them like a real firearm and you put them on display. Now, I ordered the M16 service rifle of the Marine Corps with the ACOG. So, it finally got here. We're going to assemble this bad boy. So, there we go. Oh, that's legit. So, hey, holy shit. This son of a bitch is way, way, way bigger than I thought. So, that's what it looks like. So, we are definitely going to open this bad boy up and get her assembled. And, uh, yeah. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Okay, so... <laughs> okay, it's a little tight to open. Holy shit. Okay. Alrighty, so. So, top and bottom. And lock go together. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Please. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh Oh, I think I had the wrong side. I actually I'm not too sure about this. Oh. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it was a little bit of a stickler, but I got it. Push. G into C, so... Holy shit. There we go. All right. So, here we go. Oh, non firing rounds in the magazine. Slide into mag receiver. Okay. So, you take the tiny rounds. Put them into the magazine. So right off the back, my initial impression is I am incredibly, incredibly impressed by the amount of detail 
they're able to achieve with such a small thing. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I know. It's actually sort of kind of hard to get in. So, this is a little on. Okay. Oh my goodness, I'm Butterfingers over here. Can you hold it? Got it? Yep. Actually, I'm having a really, really, really hard time with this. Jeez. Okay, we gotta get this last one in. Okay. Jeez, Louise. Uh, that was a little difficult. All right. And then you just make sure it's in there. The cool thing is, you know, it has the ejection button. So it does come out like a real gun. All right. Slide barrel grip onto bottom handguard and tighten. Come on. Oh, my bad. Oh, so you can, wait, actually, you can get this fucker a little further on if you want. Just typically where you would want it. Okay, cool. Alright, there we go. Alright, now you have the foregrip on. Then, next, you're going to want to place the ACOG. Which you can really, you can put it anywhere, but as far as like being legitimate and putting it where you really would in the gun... I got meaty fingers, so it's a little on the difficult side. Man, this thing does not want to go. Okay, finally got it. Oh. 
looks super legit. I mean, I mean, what can you say? Slide magazine until it clicks into the display. Ah. It's saying to put what? Slide magazine in until it clicks into place and show off your goat gun. Well, what is it supposed to? trying to figure out how to get it oh you were supposed to do the magazine last oh. Oh, I didn't see this little uh, metal piece that goes into the stand how does this sound gun go No, 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 clearly it's this Here. one. You might have to put that piece oh. through the bottom. Uh, I'm actually not too sure about that. No, nope, that does not appear to be the case. Mm -hmm. uh, come on, get on in. Oh, okay. Now I see. Yeah, no, I didn't originally see that. All right, there you have it, guys. That is exactly what this bad boy is supposed to look like. That is exactly what the service rifle for the Marine Corps is. Uh... M16, A2, so it's the only thing they actually have incorrect is it's not a fully automatic weapon. It is, of course, you have safe, you have semi, and you have burst. It's, there's no auto, so maybe special forces. But overall, I'm pretty impressed with the quality of this. I mean, this thing is very well made. They have plenty of others too that I'll probably be looking to take a look at whenever I get the chance. Um, but yeah, that is about it, guys. I will, in the description, I'll write out you know exactly what it is. But I will also drop a link in case you guys are interested. Now, they run a lot of sales, so it's probably the best time to get these. These can run a little expensive, but you have to keep in mind that this is all metal. All like quality metal. So the thing's not just gonna fall apart. But yeah guys, uh, oh, hey Anna, if you want a little surprise, the barrel comes off. So instead of the standard A2, Flash hider, you can have a suppressor on it. Okay, well that's sort of damn cool, but I think I'm going to keep that off personally because I'm trying to keep it historically correct. Alright guys, well that 
will wrap the video up. All right, guys. I just take pride in uh, bringing in diversity on the channel. So I thought this was something really, really, really cool that anybody would like. So, you know, goguns.com. If you if you like this video, you like what you see, you know, make sure you order it. All right, that will be it. Till next time, guys. Peace.